Hi everyone. Um, we are concentrating on the JavaScript uh, thing, and we are learning the JavaScript. Uh, in my previous movies, I have mm, shown some basic elements of JavaScript, how you can interact with user or variables, things like that. Now, less time to it's just time to move on to some more advanced topics. Now, in this tutorial, uh, I want to tell you about ifs and else. Uh, basically these are decision problems and make our script a little intelligent uh, still uh, till the previous movies the script we have got something very linear they don't have such logic somewhat uh, one one code was showing do you want to visit my page if the user button clicks on ok it still goes to my in uh, web page if it if it clicks on cancel it's still again on the on my web page so we will try to input some uh, logical ability in our programs to do so first let's start with some integer variables so where uh, x and y and let's assign them value x equals 3 and y equals 4 now the general uh, way to handle logic is using the if keyword uh, if keyword tests some condition and if that condition is true uh, the part of the body got executed if not then it's uh, then the else part and things like that so we get started with if condition and here in if if we say f is equal equal x is equal equals y then we give a second bracket and here we say uh, alert um, okay any message you can put so this is the general if structure that you follow so for the if structure um, you can uh, have a if keyword followed by opening parenthesis and then the variable or uh, and another variable this is basically a conditional uh, expression that is telling that if x is equal to y or not remember this is not a single equal these are double equals and this thing stands for comparison now there can be any other logical functions now as long as you can see that x and y are not uh, equal so it won't show ok let's uh, see in the web browser how it looks um, F5 and nothing showed up as we expected now if we put the value uh, equal say these are 4 and then you will show some message in the web browser uh, and you are having the ok dialog box so let's start simple if so at within this curly braces you in the opening curly braces you can write some more code say you want to now set x equals 0 and y equals 0 things like that so this is the basic structure of an if statement and this is the conditional logic you're having so remember the syntax this is if the keyword followed by an opening parenthesis and then the expression or the uh, comparing expression you want to perform and then its body inside the if so this is uh, about if in the next movie i will show you if else uh, conditions let's see 